If you're a camp couple and you like to consider yourselves chefs, I got to tell you, I'm standing in an RV I think you're going to love. Gordon Ramsay, ears up. This is the Heartland Mallard 267 FK, front kitchen. This beauty, we're going to call it 30 feet, 29 feet, 10 inches. 6,400 pounds, depending on the configuration you get, you can't sleep five to six. This one is set up for three to four. But the calling card, I'm going to step out the way so Aaron can show you. Look at this front kitchen. Press surface countertop up front, decorative, beautiful, modern barn decor with that lighter whitewash wood, matched in place with the whitewash shaker cabinets and the matte black poles. Love the attention grabbing that your eyes do with this coach. Undermounted stainless steel sink with a high rise matte black faucet, window on the side, but the privacy window up front to me is the calling card. This is where I could see you and your loved one after you get up making that delicious cup of coffee, sipping it, watching the sun come up over the ocean because this is your first vacation in an RV out there and you're realizing we should have done this years ago. Over on the campsite, you got more prep space as we continue around with that press surface countertop, recessed three burner cooktop here with the glass cover, and they gave me my modified mountain pattern here on the backsplash. I like this, even though it doesn't really match the flow of the inlay that you see in the countertop, it does kind of pull some of the colors together and also separates the cook space too. 16 inch oven, and look, look what I got up top. Good call, Aaron. A spice rack. They gave me a spice rack over here with a solid wood valance above my light, above my windows. Come on, man. This is an engineer saying, I'm gonna maximize the space. And yeah, I got plenty of storage here. Thanks to the drawers. I got a cabinet up top. I got the oversized 10 cubic foot fridge freezer combo that uh, is gas electric and even has the doodle station on it. So if it's raining outside or if you need to put a note out there, hey, gone fishing, need to pick up some ice, whatever, you can do it there. You want more pantry space? You got a great little inlay here in your entry point with those solid shelves, giving you good space. You also get great space here with the barrel ceilings. Over 80 inches of height, 15K BTU AC there, laminated roof, and the thing that I like about what Heartland does with the Mallard line, they give you four inches of foam insulation in the roof. Because where do you lose most of your heat and that conductivity? Right up here. This is gonna do, do a good job of keeping the temperature where you want it. When you wanna maybe get a little bit warmer, you even got the graystone fireplace here. It is electric, multi-flame setting, multi-light setting. Got your component shelf here, IRV Technologies Entertainment Center there, and how about some hidden storage up top underneath the component shelf. Great place to put, well, whatever you need to put there. I'll leave that to your imagination. Mine's bourbon. Right here, we have our mounting spot for our TV with our connection and our 110 outlet. Over here on the off camp side in the super slide is where we feature our Allure plush pillow top recliners with cup holders as well as space in the middle in that five inch console to put whatever you need to in there, remotes, whatever. Storage underneath my booth dinette here with the doors. And the thing I like about what Heartland does, they know that some people like darker accents, some people like lighter accents. So they gave you the select a style reversible cushions. So if you want lighter, flip it around. You want darker, flip it around. You got the table that will remove. So if you want to take it outside, you can, but that does reduce down into a sleeper surrounded by those large panoramic windows with the wood balances and the pleated shades. Now up front at the top, I had mentioned that kind of modern barn decor. This is where it really kind of shows with this door. Love how they did the light and the dark accent in my solid door leading to my pass-through bathroom. Now, if you swap out the recliners for a hide-a-bed sofa, pull-out sofa, you could probably get five people in this coach. So if you're in the master, you're asleep, somebody's here, they need to use the bathroom or take a shower, you're not going to disrupt each other when you need to come to the bathroom. Plastic bowl to foot flush there, oversized vanity counter here, medicine cabinet, neo-angled shower with the glass enclosure and my extra large skylight. Plus I got my adjustable fan and vent here and you come on through the pass-through bathroom and Aaron, I'm gonna step out the way because 30, 30 feet is where we're at total but this king size bed takes up a lot of the back room and there's a good reason why. King size bed. 
and it is a gel memory foam bed, but it's king size. You get a king size bed in an RV. Do you know how rare that is in travel trailers? Great option here, window there, corner storage for your cell phones or whatever. I would like to see some larger nightstand space there, but I understand because I got a king size bed and you got the frosted glass inlay in your storage there. Vent and fan here, large window on the rear wall. And how about a mirrored ward storage here with drawers underneath and a separate access point leading into the master. Got to tell you, for something that's 30 feet just under, this thing checks all the sweet spot boxes for that active couple that wants to get out, go see America the safest way possible. But more importantly, enjoy it with some creature comforts of home that a lot of RVs aren't going to have. 267 FK. Check it out. Uh, we need to check out the outside though. So hang on. Let's go do that now. So here we are on the outside of the all new Harlan Mallard 267 FK. Let's start right up front where you're going to find some nice conveniences like powered tongue jack with LED light, twin 20 pound LP tanks behind it, all seated on a sturdy 10 inch frame, battery box there, and battery disconnect. I like how they actually move that outside. It makes it easier when you do just want to cut the battery off to do it because you are set up for solar on the Heartland Mallards. Right in here in your storage compartment is your solar charge controller. Very nice little feature. Plus your compartment, which granted it is a little small, but you got magnetic, anti-slam doors and covered hinges. Tinted windows with that 80% tint all the way around. Why is that important? That helps reduce the heat on the outside if you do have that sun coming down on this one, as does the white automotive coated siding that we have here on this fiberglass coach. And the cool thing about it, you can't really see it during the day, but the graphics also glow in the dark at night. Pretty cool little feature. Heated and enclosed underbelly. You do have those powered stabilizer jacks, solid step over steps leading you into the main entry point here and another cool feature that Heartland does with the Mallards they give you the wide track suspension take a look at the space that you have in between the tires on those aluminum rims with the Dexter easy lube axles and the nitro filled tires you got your black tank flush out here power connection there still fold up steps leading you into the master bedroom there extra large awning with the led light strip as well as external shower with hot and cold right here is our four x four sewer hose storage spare tire mounted on the back we have a backup camera there plus we got the lippert mount what is that for that is there in case you want to get a ladder to get on the top just to check everything out over on the off-camp side is where you're going to find the slides those also have the 80 percent tent on the windows and I got to tell you, for a coach that's 30 feet, 29 feet, 10 inches, that weighs 6,400 pounds, with that configuration, that front kitchen, all that space, and a king size bed, if you're an active couple that wants to be active but also wants to glamp, 267 FK should be a coach you put at the top of your list. And the best part about it is you can pick this Heartland Mallard up today at your local camping world.